potential presidential candidate Jeb Bush is doing some fundraising in Florida. Today, the former governor announced an event in Bonita Springs raised more than a million dollars to support the programs of the Barbara Bush Foundation for Family Literacy. That's where we find CBS 4's Ted Scouten with more on what he's saying. Ted? Hey, Elliot. Well, Jeb Bush will be uh, taking the stage here in just a little while. What he'll be doing is he'll be reading from that new book of his, all part of this literacy fundraiser. But before all this began, we had the opportunity to speak to him about a possible run for the White House. Let's be clear. Standards are what our expectations are. Former Florida Governor Jeb Bush is celebrating reading. It's a fundraiser for his mother's project, the Barbara Bush Foundation for Family Literacy. It's great to be back here in Southwest Florida. Quickly, the topic turned to the White House and his possible run. No changes. I'm uh, seriously considering the possibility. I'm spending a lot of time traveling. He said if he runs, his family would be by his side, especially his wife, Columba. My wife is my inspiration. She's my soulmate. And she is uh, going to be involved in the campaign and keep me sane if I go beyond the consideration of thinking about this for sure. And he talked about his book of emails. It highlights more than 260,000 emails while he was governor. He explained a snafu where personal information of thousands of people was released by mistake. We asked the Secretary of State's office to make sure that they redacted these emails before they were given to outside entities. Um, and they didn't do it. And he gave an overview of his outlook if he decides to run for president, what he calls forward leaning. It's not about relitigating anything in the past. It's about um, trying to create a set of principles and ideas that will help us move forward. And he certainly sounds a lot like a candidate. He said he plans on talking about foreign policy issues next week at a speech in Chicago. Live in Bonita Springs, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News. Ted, thank you. Tonight